Good day to you, my name is Jaso and today I'm kit bashing some Orc Mega Knobs. The main base for these minis are going to be from the Blood Bowl Fire Mountain Gut Busters team. I'll be using uh, most of the ogres as well as one of the grots or noblars or whatever they're called. The first one has parts from other Blood Bowl sets, the Knob set, some Chaos stuff, it has parts from Aurox, and some bits from Imperial Guard, as well as some Styrene. The running one has parts from Aurox, Knobs, Scions, Guard, and some Space Marine Scout sets. Oh, there's also some Caradron Overlords and Moon Clan Grot parts on his gun. The last one is similar again, lots of bits from lots of previously mentioned sets just stuck on everywhere. This one also has a lucky grot shield. A quick look at the backs. Here are all the paints I'm going to use for this speed paint after the dark yellow primer. Null Noil over all of the parts that will be the metal bits. Lead Belcher is dry brushed over all of the parts we just painted with the Null Oil. Army paint a green tone for the skin of the Orcs and the Grot. Army paint a purple tone for the Camouflage Trousers. I've jumped a bit ahead here and just finished off some of the smaller parts, mainly with Army Paint a Soft Tone and Red Tone, along with Citadel E and in Yellow Contrast. Next, Liquid Talent, also known as Agrax Earthshade, is applied all over the knobs. This is what they look like, perfectly acceptable for the gaming table, but we can spend a little more time tidying them up and adding a few extra details using these few extra paints. Here are the final Mega Knobs, ready to join my slowly increasing green tide. Yes, I still have one more that I need to make. Um, I'll do that in the future sometime. Thank you very much for watching this, probably the last October 2021 video. If you like what you've seen here today, then please consider subscribing and all of that stuff. If anyone has any questions or suggestions, then please comment below.